18th of October 2020, I uploaded my first ever YouTube video. If you have been watching me since from the start you know I used to upload gameplay videos on my channel. I have played many games. The specs I had at that time were 2GB RAM, Intel Core Duo CPU, and for graphics I had the integrated Intel G41 Express chipset. I used to play games and at the same time record the gameplay. For recording I used OBS, yes on that PC I used OBS to record videos. <laughs> and it recorded videos pretty decently. I used OBS for a while, then after a year later I got my first ever GPU, the GT710. And as you know when you have a NVIDIA GPU, you have a great inbuilt software for recording which is NVIDIA Shadow Play. So according to NVIDIA low-end GPUs like the one I am having does not support that feature, but does not matter, people found a way around it, using which you can easily use Shadow Play on GPUs which does not support it. I am telling you it's the best software ever to record anything, and kept using it for a while. Then I bought my second GPU, the GT1030 which also didn't support Shadowplay, but I knew what I had to do to make it possible. All was going well, and my recordings were smoothest ever possible. But that day came. Don't know the date, but, around the end of 2022, the NVIDIA GPUs got a new driver update. So just like a normal person I updated my graphics driver to the latest version. And I regret doing that till date, because it changed everything. After that driver update the shadow play stopped working, like literally stopped. And I am telling you guys, I tried every possible solution, every solution available on the internet, but none of them worked. So, now it was time to look for another recording software, and started to test every software which was available in the market. Softwares like OBS Studio, Streamlabs, Fraps, Bandicam, Video Solo, and many more, you name it, none of them recorded smoothly. Even though I had a GPU the GT1030, but it was of no use for recording because of this. So, all the tasks were in the hands of my CPU. I had the, and still have the Intel 3rd generation i3 processor, which was not good at all. After searching for days and weeks, I finally found a software which decently recorded videos on my low-end PC. MSI Afterburner, yes this software is mainly for overclocking your GPU, but it also has a feature of recording videos. So, I gave it a try and it worked well. There were no performance issues, and it was kind of smooth compared to other softwares. I used it for recording for a while, but started to notice that. In the recorded output video the gameplay was smooth at the start, but as we move further the gameplay became laggy, choppy, and stuttering. It was really annoying, and I was totally frustrated. Ah oh, shit, here we go again. Again, I was on the search for a recording softwares that will record videos smoothly. After trying more softwares and experimenting them on my PC, finally recently, I found the perfect recording software for my low-end PC. And you must know that this video is not sponsored by any of the software I mentioned. So while searching on Google and YouTube for recording softwares, I came across these up recording software. I was already low on hopes, so I just gave it a try, and hear me out it was worth trying. The software recorded my gameplay smoothly and without causing performance issues while playing games, and the output were also smooth. Not that smooth, but better than every other softwares I tried. It was nearly perfect. So, guys I still use that software to record videos, and it is the best one yet. Till date, I am satisfied with the software, and it worked wonders for me. If you have a low-end PC just give it a try and you will not regret it. Trust me, now let me show you the best recording settings and help you. Go to Google, download, and install the software. It's not free but you all know how to get the premium version. Now open the software. So, make sure to select the game recording mode for smoothly recording gameplay videos. Now go to settings here, just follow me and do as I say. Change the video format to MP4, quality to default. Set the FPS to 30 or 60. Now you have to try which works best on your PC. In audio, change the format to MP3 and select the highest available bitrate and sample rate. For the most important setting, scroll down and tick the Enable GPU Hardware Acceleration, and your software is ready to record smooth gameplay videos. This is actual footage I recorded using this software on my low-end PC. So, in case this software does not works for you,
then here is the list of some of the best recording softwares if you really have a low end PC. You have no idea. I have more recording softwares that I will tell you in the further videos. So, we are now at the beginning of the end. I know it's hard to do anything like playing games, making content and many more, if you have a low end PC, but it's not impossible. I have gone through the same and even worse, so I totally understand you, but you only have the power to change it, trust me and just start doing whatever you want to do, does not matter if you have a 2GB RAM or an Intel Core 2 Duo, I am here to help you, and so are millions of others on internet who can help you, so, guys hope you enjoyed this video, and it helped you, if this video inspired even one person, I know this video was worth making. I am low-end gaming and this was my story. I started YouTube with a 2GB RAM, Intel Core 2 Duo and an Intel G41 Express chipset. What's your excuse? Oh, this